I did one in uh, St. Louis. It was at a comedy club in the shopping mall. And uh, the club owner is kind of like showing me the club and he's like uh, telling me the schedule. And he's like, just casually, as an aside, he goes, oh, on Saturday Night Late Show, it's going to be all gay bikers. <laughs> and, I was like, and I was like, oh, yeah, that's, that's a good one. Just you, as you, an aside. Yeah, yeah, just like, yeah. It's like yeah. you can try harder next time if you're going to come up with something. Because he just kind of threw it out there. And a Saturday Late Show's gay bike. So I'm kind of gay. Nice one. That's, that's funny. It's a funny attempt at a joke. And then anyway, of course, cut to Saturday Late Show. I look out at the line, and it was just like, you know, an open call for the village people or something. It was just like 300 full-on leather bikers lined up in the middle of a mall in St. Louis. And they were a great audience. And it was just like, God, I should... Oh, that actually wasn't good. Yeah, it was, they were super. I mean, it was really fun. And yeah. it's, just, it's just crazy to look out yeah, into the crowd and just see, see of, of, of gay bikers. Bear, gay bears. Just yeah, just like. <laughs> but uh, it didn't lead to other gay biker shows, though. You're saying you didn't get a gay biker following? <laughs> I didn't get to start touring. I, I'm doing the gay biker convention circuit. <laughs> Whenever there's a gay biker convention, right, yeah. I'm their go-to comic. You're going to be the gay biker comic. They're just going to love you. You're going to be like their Barbara Streisand. That's what you're going to be like. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it was just funny that I assumed he was... Joking. Yeah, because he just kind of said it real casually as if that's something you hear every time you go. With yeah. Book. It sounds like a stock joke that, all he gay that he tells people. Yeah. But it's just the actual thing. No, he knew that because that's what just happens every Saturday late show? No, no, no. There was an actual gay biker convention in town <laughs> in St. Louis. <laughs> and uh, they booked the night. <laughs> that's funny, man. Did they, did, what did they like? Did they like any material in particular? Or did they... You know, I don't remember what I said. I... I Knowing me and knowing really anyone who would go on stage, yeah. it'd be weird to just go up there and not acknowledge. Yeah. So you, were, yeah. So but I pretty much, I think, just did my my non-gay biker act. <laughs> yeah. and, you, mean, you, uh, you stayed away from your gay biker jokes. Yeah. yeah. And uh, yeah, there were. It was fun. It was just. It was just kind of. It was extra fun just because it was such a crazy situation. Right. Just to look out. I mean, just. The audience usually just kind of always looks the same. And it's funny, I feel like you didn't get heckled, right, while you were there? No, no. But it's so funny, like, I feel like you had the biker part would have wanted to heckle, but the gay part keeps them back from... <laughs> also, I was like, like polite I biker. was unaware that the gay biker movement was so big. It was just yeah. Like, like, yeah, there's, there's conventions. <laughs> like, I didn't think that all gay bikers in the world could fill a comedy club. <laughs> but yeah. They did it. They did it. Are there any gay bikers out there? <laughs> You have friends in I St. have experience. Louis. I'm seasoned. <laughs> I've done the one show that one time. <laughs>